We're back, ladies and gentlemen. It's Detective Agent, and I'm here to catch the crooks. I've been gone for a few weeks. The crooks have been creeping and crawling all over the place. So for the day, I'm gonna be Operative Agent. Hmm. Hey, is that me right here? I didn't even watch this video. I'm a, oh, sorry. Is that me right here? Oh, Elms got caught. <laughs> NBA 2K21 is right around the corner, and that gives plenty of people incentive to just cap. Not gonna lie, there'd be times where I think to myself, Am I capping too hard? <laughs> but some of these people, man, they have no conscience. Not gonna lie to you, I haven't searched before. There's a good chance that nobody's done this and I'm just about to bust nobody. And if that's the case, I'm gonna lose my job. Detective agent, man, straight out of the FBI. I'm a real FBI agent, guys. Remember that. Hey, if y'all new to the channel, man, you haven't already, subscribe! Where we at? I don't know, we're trying to get to 1.5 or right around the corner. You not subscribed, you watching the video, hit the button. Now, once you've done that, top link in the description of my second channel. Gotta subscribe to that one. Oh, have I been zooming out instead of zooming in? Guys, I'm bad at my job. My fault. So this is zoom in. Subscribe to my second channel. Link at the top of the description. Hop on YouTube real quick. Search up NBA 2K21 gameplay. Ooh, we got some crooks here today, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, you're about to get busted. It's your final free day, buddy. Top rank, we got the infamous Hunzi. Back at it again, NBA 2K21 official gameplay footage, PS5, Xbox. So this video, we're looking for just enough evidence to bust these guys. I'm having too much fun with these zooms. Not gonna lie, I might need a professional zoomer real quick. Let me call one. Are you not home right now? Could you, I need some, I need your help. There's big, big stuff here. I need your help, please come. I'm ready, I got big stuff, you know what I'm saying? Huh? He probably didn't mean that. Okay, let's look at our first suspect here. Well, he can't be a suspect till we have evidence, but um, you know, sometimes you don't need evidence. You can just make up reasonable doubt. Uh, what? Cut that out the video. Detective agent, let's watch our first video. If you're looking to buy a stacked NBA I'm not. I'm not. He's known for scamming, so I'm not. Big shout out to Y2K Sports for providing the footage exactly like this. Now I'm going to show you some gameplay, everything like that, of what 2K21 could look like. I know we all have high hopes for 2K21, and I'm really, really excited to see what they can do this year, because I'm expecting a great basketball game. Now this is not for sure NBA 2K21, this is just a concept of what- ah! Kiddo, you've been busted. In the title here, I was led to believe this was official. Is it not official now? Now, because 2K21. Is there a reason you're playing copyrighted music in the background? You trying to make me make no money? Hunzi, you knew I was gonna find this video. Now, this is some NCAA footage. Now, this, we might be getting in 2K21. What? NCAA. No, we're not. Now, if you don't know, the we're NCAA not. just changed the rule so that players can make money off of their name. So that means that huh? video game companies are allowed to use their name in video games and basically make NCAA video games. Uh, Hanzi, number one thing you have to do today, today, today is to disable resample in Sony Vegas. We'll lead, show them a tutorial. Hi Hanzi. I don't want to confuse you too much. Like just, just focus and follow along. Just go up right here. Very simple. Click the button right here. Boom. Very simple. Go all the way down to the bottom. Very simple. Click it. Make sure it says disable. Very simple. And then click OK. That's it. It's not hard stuff. And it's going to make the ghosting look so much better. I'm trying to help out your videos. I need you to start bamboozling more people <laughs> so that I could bust you in a bigger scandal and catch your boss. I think that's how it works in the movies. Double A into. What's going on? Yeah, you're here today. OK, so I need some. This is some big stuff I need your help with. You're actually already doing it. I need cinematic zooms when I say, well, like when I when I say I busted you, I need you to zoom in. High quality though. Could like, you do that for me? On your face? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, there's a lot of data I'm looking at right now, but Hunzi, it looks to me like you're a fraud. How'd it look? Cause I actually can't see that, that one, I think it was good. Is Let's there? try it again, do one more take. I'm looking at the evidence here, Hunzi. It looks like you're a fraud. That was good? Yeah, that was good. Right. Thank you so much. Appreciate that. Hey, just so you guys don't get absolutely bamboozled, y'all have to be careful who y'all watching your footage from, you feel me? This is the rule of thumb, all right? Moving on, as we move on from this point forward. If it's on YouTube for more than an hour, it is fake or 2K released it themselves. 
And now if 2K release it themselves, you could actually just watch it on 2K's channel. Or go to like a respected person like Chris Smooth. You gonna know Chris Smooth not gonna drop no fake gameplay. You gonna know it's the real thing. If Hunzi was the one to release some leaked footage, even if it's on your phone, you're recording like a screen, like a TV, they would strike your channel down so fast you wouldn't know what hit you. And there'd be no point of detective agents. I'm here to catch the frauds. This is gonna be some leaked gameplay, guys, in the next couple months, right? And it's gonna be on the internet very briefly before it gets struck in. You know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta know where to look. And honestly, I feel like you find some more on Twitter than you will on YouTube. But I will give Hunzi the detective agent speaking. Hunzi did not cap and say that this was official footage. He's just playing it real, like he's on the tippity toe. He's tippity toeing like this on the line. Bamboozled us with a good quality title, first look demo, official gameplay. When we got to the video, he didn't try and convince us it was real. Unlike his fake glitch videos in which he does that all the time. Okay, I need some more evidence. 2K21, that would be the hope. And that would be really cool to see. So this is what it could look like. Now this is some really fluid gameplay. If you just take a look at how these players are moving, everything like that, this looks really, really good. Now, if 2K21 can look anything like this, Ah, Hans, you're so preliminary. You have a caveman brain. I explained this on our podcast, link in the description. I went in depth. But let me give you a brief synopsis of why if 2K21 next gen looked like this, you would all hate him. Cause 2K13 looked like this. Not graphically, but in terms of the animations and the gameplay. 2K looks unrealistic because it's relying on your garbage input to say, what do I do in the game? What do I do? In this, they're just trying to make it look as real as possible. Everything is already predetermined. In 2K13, everything was predetermined. If 2K looked like this, the input delay would be so massive that when you click something on your controller, you'd you did your little dribble move, it would take centuries to complete that move in the game. The only time 2K should look like this, Hunzi, I want you to pay close attention, is if you leave your goddamn controller down and it loads into AI versus AI game, then I don't mind it looking like that. I'd be super happy. You see how real this looks? Oh you my god. You see the God. Player models. If 2K21 look looks like this, I guarantee you, I'm gonna start making goddamn Little Big Planet videos because I refuse to play a game this goddamn ugly. Now, graphically, it looks kind of like sweet, you know what I'm saying? Now, Hunzi did horrible render settings on the video, so it doesn't really, you don't really get a chance to see it like that. God damn it, and this is why, you know what I'm saying? This is why we can't just have everybody, like we can't have the whole, like some of y'all, we can't have the Hunzis of the world making any kind of decisions here. <sighs> I'm sweating now, guys. I take my job real seriously, it's detective agent. Let's look for some more evidence. NBA 2K21 full gameplay NCAA concept. Ooh, okay, okay. This is fine. Now, is he gonna bamboozle some people? Yes, but it's just a really clickbaity title. He put concept in the title. He's not bamboozling to the degree of a Hunzi. I'm gonna leave you alone, Y2K. NBA 2K21 leaked next gen gameplay insane quality. Uh oh! Hold on, oh, of course, I knew it. Yo, the second I saw this footage blow up on Twitter, I was like, I know people's gonna cap about this on YouTube by tomorrow, by tomorrow. What do you know, man? Look look here, look here, look here. Why is there no audio? Come on, come on, there was literally audio in the original clip. Did you somehow make the video worse? How was that possible? How did you do that? That actually takes effort. Did you know that to make the video this much worse? For those wondering where this gameplay is from, uh, Toasted explained it on Twitter. It's basically like a whole bunch of uh, uh, gambling addicts just bet on these games. It's like virtual basketball. So it's it, it looks real, it's all simulation, and people just sit there betting on this bullshit for some reason. I guess since the NBA is not around, people's getting real desperate right about now. And I'm not gonna lie, graphically, aside from their faces, like the bodies and everything, they might have, they might all have very thick asses, but aside from that, like graphically, bro, the textures, it looks solid, man. It's, they're not spamming sweat like 2K. The lighting engine, the way it reflects off the floor looks mad realistic. It doesn't look overly cinematic, it looks real. You can't tell that because YouTube processing is garbage. So it's already processed as I'm watching it and then it's gonna process again while y'all watch it and it's not gonna look as clear as it did on Twitter. He didn't even try and like commentate over it or convince us of anything. He was just like, I'm gonna take this clip, remove the audio, upload it with this juicy title right here and get 2,700 views. <laughs> Which is actually not as much as I thought he was gonna get. Man, as I scroll through all these videos, I'm not gonna lie to y'all, I'm impressed. 
I jet ass thought that I was gonna find hundreds, hundreds of examples of people just capping out their mind. But no, it's just people trying to use juicy titles like Swante, NBA 2K21 leaked gameplay footage, 2K21 pie charts, my career built. Oh no, he capping for sure. He don't have not, not, hold on, Swante. Here to save y'all a headache, man. Okay. I'm here. Okay. To bring you the truth. All right. And also, um, Ronnie 2K talks about 2K21, and we gonna go over some of those sound bites because the quality is in one. Anywho, as you can see, this boy here, right? Owen B. Jones, okay? This guy, right? <laughs> so many people are sending me this TikTok, right? Look at this. 1.4 million views. 1.2 million views. One point. Like, like, wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. God, who's fall? Are y'all falling for this stuff? Y'all, y'all been, y'all been doing this for how long? You been playing video games for? Y'all still falling for this stuff? This detective agent, I'm trying to save y'all from the inevitable doom that is your expectations. Look at this. Do you, man? What, are, man? What the f is of my world? And how would Owen B. Jones have been the only one in the world to get this exclusive content? Who is he? Guys, there is gonna be plenty of leaked gameplay. You wanna know how you're gonna find it? When 2K has an event, like, but honestly, then they might all be canceled now, I'm not sure. Usually, like at a Gamescom, at PAX, at E3, around those times, you might be able to find some phone footage, right? But this looks like somebody's goddamn home. So unless it's a QA tester or something like that, which I highly doubt, then this is not real, man. The verdict? Detective agent here decides there's not enough evidence to prosecute. A am I? That, is that what FBI agents do? I don't really know what my job description is. So I rate what Swante is doing. He just he doing exactly what this video is doing. I'm gonna have a juicy title, but it's not gonna be a lie, and I'm gonna get some views off of it. That's how this YouTube works, fellas. Now it, it's even funnier when someone does it on Twitter because there's actually no apparent benefit to getting Twitter retweets, <laughs> except that it might make you feel better. NBA 2K21 G League gameplay leaked on the PS5? It's the same gameplay. Guys, the fucking version of this with audio exists on Twitter. Are you all so lazy that you all stole it from the same YouTuber who was incompetent? Okay, so this is what I'm talking about when, I, when I'm talking about these animations here. Just so you guys have a good idea. I, I needed some visual evidence here. We're gonna do a breakdown here from Detect- Oh, that's quality. <laughs> we don't wanna touch that. He's gonna drive left. He beats this guy. He's in bad defensive position. That's fine. But look, as he continues to drive, he's gonna go into a pro hop. Now, these are the animations I'm talking about. Now, when you play NBA 2K, when you click triangle, depending on where you click triangle, your block rating, your badges, there's gonna be a higher or lower likelihood that you get a favorable animation, right? But in this situation here, this NYC guy doesn't have much options. When this guy decided to go up for the shot, it was already determined. And then he doesn't get the, this is gonna happen so, you're gonna lose your minds when LeBron is driving. That's the problem with 2K13. Spin dunk, spin dunk, spin dunk. Spin dunk was so overpowered because it would give you such a retardedly favorable animation that when you play game battles or in any amateur circuit, that move was banned. If you did it in game, you forfeited the game. Oh man, do not go back to the times of predetermined animations. I will lose my mind and stop playing 2K. I refuse. 2K13 was one of the worst 2Ks of all time. And, and, and some people like have good memories because Jay-Z was on the soundtrack. Who cares? Jay-Z's on Spotify and every other app. Go there and listen to him. I get serious about this stuff, guys. Agent Zero here, man. I apologize ahead of time. I'm always right. I'm an officer of the law. This is not G League gameplay, obviously. These are not G League teams, obviously. This is just random cities playing simulated games. And what looks very smooth and realistic, if we're being honest, even graphically looks so goddamn real, it's truly impressive. Look at that. All of that is impressive. All of this is impressive. The fact that they were able to do this just for gambling addicts, that's crazy to me. But this is obviously not G League gameplay. Obviously, these are not G League teams. That'd be the first sign. Let's scroll into the comments. He has two comments. Uh, what is this anyway? Why are the player movements look so real? That shit fire. Taz, Taz told us that right there. Okay, Paris Wave, I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna determine that you are a fraud! And I have enough evidence, ladies and gentlemen, to indict you! You're out of here, buddy. Get him out of here. Not gonna lie to you guys. There's a whole lot of wholesome clickbait going on. Not malicious, wholesome. Look here, Jumpman, NBA 2K21 League Park gameplay animations. Yup, this was the mocap stuff. This is the mocap stuff right here. He's not capping. This is what we refer to in the industry as wholesome clickbait. Bait.
Actually, this is not even 2K21. This is old 2Ks. What the, what the hell? 21, you know what I'm saying? Using the Roco Coco mocap suit. All right, what? as you guys can see, man, I got the suit on. Wait, what's that original video? How does this only have 20,000 views, man? Uh, this is from Crypto. Oh, I feel like I've met him before. Tax animations, you know what I'm saying? Cause you know, everybody know about the dance, you feel? How are you doing everybody this? Everybody know about the dance, so let's get it, bro. So this first thing I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna, I'm gonna make the basket, you know, when I hit it green, you know How what are I'm you saying? doing this? green, bro. You gotta, you gotta hit that mark one time, so all right, let's get it. Guys, how is he doing this? First of all, it doesn't look that great on the animation department, but the fact that he's doing this is crazy. What is a Rokoku Smart Suit Pro? What the hell is that? An entire motion capture studio in one markerless suit, enabling creators at all levels to turn any space into a professional motion capture stage. Now, what do you do with these animations, though? Once you once you sit there and do this right here, what do you do with the animation? NBA 2K21 Orlando Bubble Showcase. He, he really added the TNT the mod, you know what I'm saying, the presentation mod. He did a court mod, kind of like Infamous did, well like Venice Beach and all that. You videos linked down below and in the description and stuff like that. I can't even be mad at the clickbait. If he's the person who made this mod, that's impressive. You know what I'm saying? All he really did was change 2K20 to 2K21. Now if he's not the one who made this mod, then he pushing it a little bit. But I would like to, ooh. <laughs> Anthony Davis, you moving like this and like that? Why Tatum always getting dunked on his I'm kidding, I just wanted to piss off one person from Boston at least. Hey, I wanna play this mod. Is this mod available? I wanna play it right now, immediately, this instant. Thumbs up for J.R. Smith's uncontested air ball. No, not J.R. Not, not J.R. Final determination from Detective Agent. You're good. You're good. I'm not even gonna go after you, man. I'm gonna let you slide this way. Just cause I'm impressed. Just cause of that. <laughs> man, there's so much wholesome action going on, man. NBA 2K21 graphics on next gen possibilities. Look at this, man. That's just a good quality title right there. There's nothing wrong with that. Graphics for each NBA 2K game has continued to get better and better with each console generation. Who is this guy? I've never even seen back him before. Some new folks in the 2K community, you gotta love to see it. Oh man, nah, he wildin' right now. This is too far right here. 2K21 prelude leaked? Oh man. It's the same goddamn O and B footage. It ay ay ay. Yo, guys, from now on, all right, this is how we gonna do it, all right? If the footage lasts over six hours on the internet, it is not real, okay? Unless. 2K themselves released it. I, yo, 2K allows most things. Like, they, they don't mind when people sit there and criticize the game. They don't mind when people say this, that, the third, whatever. But they do mind when things get leaked. I swear to God. We almost saw Chris Move get striked a few years ago over it. We saw players like Shake and Bake. It was somebody big at the time, man. They got striked too for showing, for leaking something early. This detect, I want y'all to be safe. I want your expectations to not be so sky high that everybody's disappointed, man. That's a lesson in life. Lower your expectations. Don't gas yourself too much or you get hate the final product. No matter how good it is, be skeptical. Do some investigative analysis and come to your own goddamn conclusion, man. All right, so this is what I'm talking about. Like a month ago, there was a leak on Twitter, randomly, out of nowhere. Five affiliations in 2K21, nah, this gotta be cap, right? And it was, it was over like 2K21, for some reason was already 3% off, even though it hasn't even fucking released yet. It was like a goddamn 10 year old wrote this out. Not, not a billion, five multi-billion dollar corporation got their best guy on the case to help sell the game. This is what it came out looking like. In NBA 2K21, for the first time ever, look, you're supposed to use a comma right there. Already, grammar incorrect. Multi-billion, by the way. Players get access to all 12 teams in the WNBA. Women's, and just in case y'all didn't know what the WNBA was, NBA fans. And access to all 68 college teams in the NCAA. The NCAA will be available in Play Now. Play Now doesn't have a dash. And a My Career Path. And the W, Hughes, and twice in the goddamn same sentence, man. I'm not an English teacher, but I know the multi-billion. Multi-billion, guys. Come on, a 12-year-old wrote this out. 12. Let's stop. Let's stop for a moment and just like, let's not jump to conclusions. Because although grinding was just asking a question there, there was plenty of people that genuinely were like, Woo! Woo! And I was like, guys, how many times you can fall for the same trap, man? There is gonna be times where even I'm like, man, there's a chance, there's like 10%, maybe 40% chance that shit right there is real. 
but I'm a detective. I'll continue to detect. <laughs> detect the cap. Hey, fellas, man, if you guys are new, you haven't already, drop a like. <laughs> Subscribe to the channel, second channel link in the description, podcast link in the description, AMP link in the description, man. Appreciate y'all. I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'm out.